Hi guys, you're watching GT channel and this is episode 10 of my 5th leveling series in the Ghoul Wars 2 game. So let's continue with my main story quest. Now I need to go and talk to the Logan Takere at the tavern. So where is this tavern place? It's right here. So it looks like I'm going into the right direction. Or maybe not. Maybe where is the damn entrance to this tavern place? I have no clue. So the star, the green shiny star is right here, but I don't know where is the entrance. Is this the entrance? Well, no, it doesn't look like this is the entrance. So maybe I missed the entrance at the, at the place I was before. Damn it, it's quite annoying. Quite confusing building right here. So the arrows, the arrows pointing me in this direction. Yes, I need to go right here. And this is the tavern, yeah. The damn tower and I need to talk to this guy. Logan Takerai. Thanks for coming. Not too busy to have a word with me, are you? I need some information about a thug named Two Blade Pete. Pete, huh? Yeah, I know him. He's always been trouble. These days, the less I have to do with him, the better I like it. Glad to hear that. His gang's mischief's getting downright deadly. Know anything about what they might be planning next? I just helped my friend Quinn settle a score with him. I heard a member of his gang mention an apothecary. That mean anything to you? Apothecary? Hmm. Pete's goons have been sniffing around in Shaymore. There's an apothecary there. That might be their next target. My friend Quinn is mixed up in this. Can you give me a chance to talk him out of it? Well, it's asking a lot, but for the hero of Shaymore, I'll try. Get Quinn out fast. My soldiers will move in as soon as they see trouble. Good luck, hero. But be careful. So now I need to... What do I need to do here? Wow, look at this, I'm kind of crazy. I can... And I got some rewards, nice. So let's check the rewards, and the rewards are... Shit, total shit, because I'm level 8 now. But these rewards are for level 6 only. But anyway, just gonna take something right here. What's next? Complete, and I just got insane amount of experience, 1000 eggs for completing this. This is just some crazy shit. I like main story quest. Getting very nice eggs buffs from this quest. So now I need to go... I need to go out? No, I need to find Queen at the apothecary. So I got some kind of tip here, after completing an area, click this icon to instantly return to entrance. Or you may use the warm up to travel elsewhere. So now let's exit this instance, because I completed my main event. So now I need to exit it, yeah, let's go out. So now let's go and search for the queen. Wherever do I need to go? So let's again search for the green shiny star at this place and I need to go out. I need to teleport right here to the Duena waypoint and exit this big huge town. So I just left the town, the big town right there and now I'm going towards, towards this location right here, the apothecary. I need to go there and talk Queen out of joining the bandits. So let's go. Damn, these trees look quite strange. The color of the tree, look at that. It's like some kind of like green, brownish and dark, dark yellow. Strange, very strange color of the trees in this game. But anyway, let's just go. Move along towards this building right here. There it is, this must be the place where I need to go inside. And this is gonna be my story. Enter the instance. So this must be the place. And the lame part about this, like some kind of story quest line, when you join the instance, you must fully complete it. If you just complete half of it and then exit the game, then you have to like, do it again, all over again, all of those quests. Please don't kill me. I've given you everything you asked for. What are you doing? We don't need to hurt her. We do what Pete says, and Pete says she dies. Yeah? Well, well, I say no way. Say whatever you want. 
but I'm not leaving her alive. And now I need to kill the bandits. Defeat the bandits and kill the bitch. Kill the bitch. Well, there are a lot of bitches here. And the last one, bandit scout, is dead too. Loot her and she dropped some kind of shredded garment. Salvaging material. And there are some more bandits. Let's take them down. Bandits just don't stand a chance against me because I'm high level at this place. Defend the apothecary from the bandits. And the quest is completed or not? No. There's some another one coming this way. Damn bitch. Just die. Die you and I gonna switch to my pistols. Let's check out the pistols. Look at this. I like this skill very much. It's like multi-shot. I'm shooting a lot of rounds at the target. Dealing some crazy damage. But I don't think that pistols are that, that damaging. My daggers are way better. They deal way more damage I think. But still, pistols are very nice to have too. It's very good to use the pistols against a running target. So the target cannot escape me. Look at this. This is just total easy mode. I can kite the target. And kill the rest of them. So let's loot the loots. Some crappy drops from them. And let's take down the water one bandit highwayman. You're gonna die. Just die. And that's it. Check on the apothecary. Looking good. What do I do now? So I have no clue. I guess I need to explore and check out this building. What is inside this. So I'm gonna switch to my daggers back. And I need to talk to this NPC. I had things under control, but I'm glad you showed up. As am I. We owe you our lives. Thank you. But they took my entire supply of rhizome powder. It's a strong poison. Poison? Quinn, what's going on? The Seraph will be here any second. If we tell them what Pete's planning, they can stop it. You're working with the Seraph? When did you become a rat? Don't you know you can't trust the law? I trust Thackeray more than Two Blade. Come on, you wouldn't help stab one person. Why would you help poison dozens? Be smart for once. Lay low until Thackeray makes his move, and Pete's either dead or in prison. But I... but I... I... Ah, uh, you're right. Listen, thanks for saving me. I'll do what you say and hold up until all this blows over, and... Hey, thanks again. So now I need to speak to Logan Takerain, the, the guard. Over in the you heard the commotion, <laughs> but it looks like you took care of it. Please allow me to introduce Countess Anise, advisor to the royal court and master exemplar of the Shining Blade. What happened here? The apothecary's safe, but Pete's gang got away with a lot of poisonous rhizome powder. I feel responsible. I couldn't stop them in time. Let me help you deal with it. Certainly. If you can find out when and where they plan to use the poison, we can shut Two Blade Pete down for good. Pete's gang knows I was here. When none of his people return from this job, Two Blade will be out for my blood. Don't worry. My magic can disguise you as a common bandit. You can walk among them, and they'll never know it's you. We'll give you the location of their hideout. It's dangerous, but if you're willing, I know you can handle it. Consider it done. I want to put Two Blade Pete out of business even more than you do. Very well, then. I'll cast it on you now, but the disguise won't activate until you're close to the bandit headquarters. When you're ready, head to this location on your map. My scouts tell me Pete's men are hiding there. You'll be on your own, so be careful. Happy hunting. Stand still for a moment, and I'll place the enchantment on you. Done. When you reach the bandit cabin, you will be transformed. Undercover work is tricky. To pull this off, you'll have to eat, breathe, think, and stink like a bandit. Oh, that was pretty cool animation of that skill. Nice. And I got some kind of completed, completed quest and I got some rewards. Very nice rewards. The items that I already have in my inventory. So I'm just gonna take something. Copper mining pick, yeah, gonna zip it and that's it. 
And damn, the quest, this quest, the main story quest give quite a lot of experience. Just huge amount of eggs. So that's why I was such a low level because I didn't do my main story quest. So now I need to go, go back right here. I need to go towards this green pointer. Exit to Queensdale, yes. My main quest is that I need to speak with Seraph Archer north of Shaimur Garrison. So now I need to go towards this place right here, where the green icon is glowing. The green star. So let's move on, can I like teleport there? Is there a teleporter somewhere around here? No, this is the correct way to go. And this is the fast way to go. So let's just move on. Can I jump this cliff and not die? Let's be a little more careful. Glide these damn cliffs. I took a little fall damage, but it's okay. So there is the archer, the Seraph archer that I need to talk to. And he says something, but okay, I guess the base is very near this place, somewhere around. So let's check the map. There it is. Wow, this place is still not discovered by me. So I have to like walk towards that location. So I'm gonna try to skip some of these drakes. Damn it, he's already attacking me, I think. Yeah, he is. Damn, river drake. Just gonna die, you stupid lizard. And it's dead, that's it. Gonna get the loot, and there's some kind of NPC staying right there, bandit scout. Maybe I'm gonna transform into a bandit, I think. Yeah, let's check it out. It's just attacking me, what the hell? How do I transform into a bandit? I got the spell, maybe I need to like go inside the hideout first, before I can transform, I guess so. Let's just go, I'm gonna ambush this guy too, shadow step and let's kill him. Kill the bitch, I'm gonna die, few more hits and he is dead. And I got some kind of, some dye, some bottle of dye. So let's click on it, use and fresh green dye. So let's preview it. Damn, everything loads so slow. Well, it looks, it looks kind of lame. So anyway, just gonna learn it. Use, okay. I got it. So now I need to, where do I need to go? Where is this damn hideout place? Some rocks here and I need to go further. Yeah, I need to cross this river. Swim in the lake. Wow, look at the swimming. This is the first time I'm swimming in the lake. The animation of swimming looks amazing. I'm swimming like super fast, I'm like torpedo. Damn, this is just insane. Anyway, another, some kind of creature is attacking me. Damn it, you're gonna die. Die, you stupid mob. And it's dead, that's it. So now there is the hideout. This must be the hideout. So okay. Come on, load the damn. Little button still didn't load. It's an empty button. Finally, yes, enter the instance. So here I am, I'm in disguise as a bandit. And this is the door that I need to unlock. Okay, well, my disguise looks not bad, not bad at all. Very nice looking armors. But the hairstyle is kinda, kinda lame, lame hairstyle, but anyway, let's just open the door. The door have been unlocked, and now let's go inside. An unfamiliar place. Look what the script dragged in. Who are you? I'm new. Just got sprung and I'm eager to prove myself. Pete said to check around and make myself useful. Good, there's plenty to be done. Just make sure you stay out of the way. And if nobody else has anything for you, check back with me. I'll put you to work. So now I need to speak with Crusher Dan. Is this the guy? Yes, this is the guy. And I need to talk to him. Are you talking to me? Okay, gonna skip all this and that's it. Now I need to kill the drakes infesting the cave pots. So I need to kill these river drakes or not? Wow, look at this. This is just a huge drake right here. On top of this thing. So let's take it down. Damn Drake, oh my god, it's a fire Drake. He like spits fire at me, holy cow. So I need to clear this place from all the Drakes. So let's go under the water. 
Oh, I got some kind of spear. Look at the spear. This is just insane. This is the underwater combat. This is the first time I see this kind of thing. Wow, it looks amazing. Pretty epic thing. Underwater combat. So underwater I'm using the spear. And I have only one skill, stab your foe. But my other skills are still not unlocked. And damn it, I'm dying here, so I'm gonna go into steel a little to recover some of my health back and now let's kill this other one. Damn drakes. But damn, this just looks amazing. Underwater fighting is epic in this game. And I learned just myself a new skill. A new skill is... Damn it, I need to go underwater again. The skill is... Flanking Strike. So I need to check it out. How does it look? So it's just like hit from a from a side, the enemy. Look at this. Bam! Just hit the damn drake. Take down this other drake right here. I think this is the last drake that is in the water. Now let's go up. Let's go swim to the shore and kill all of the drakes at this place. This is my main quest that I have at the moment. In this hideout, in this guys. And that's it. Now I need to go back and speak with the Crusher Dan. Where is that guy? Stupid Dan. Let's go. Let's go talk to this guy. Give me another challenge then. You got something strong around here. Okay, gonna skip all of this. Place the bait on the stone outside. I need to place the bait on the stone outside. So I need to go outside. Well, okay. Let's go. Let's go do it. Let's do this quest. And it's night again. Seriously, what the hell with the weather in this game? I play for 10 minutes, it's daytime, then I play 10 minutes more, then it's nighttime again. It's quite weird. Anyway, this is the rocks. Set the bait. Place the meat on the rocks, okay? So what do I do now? I need to defeat some kind of creature. All scab fin, wow. This is some kind of elite monster, I think. Yeah, it looks like elite monster. Level 7, but he has a lot of health. Damn bastard, so let's take him down. I'm gonna steal the skill. And use the skill on him. Some kind of strange stun, wow. This guy has some stuns. Gonna evade all of his attack and he gonna go down like a bitch. You little lizard. Just gonna die, that's it. Few more hits and he's dead. Come on. Just die. All scab thing has been defeated. That's it. Let's go back to the Dan and finish this quest. Need to speak with him again. Maybe he gonna give me some more objectives to complete. Are you talking to me? Okay, there's a lot of a lot of options right here that I can say to him. So okay, give me some something else to do. Speak with Doc Howler. So now I need to talk to some other person right here. But I think I'm gonna continue my questing adventure in the later episodes. So I hope you enjoyed, thanks for watching, bye.